Ladies, ladies, we have to get to the bag. The bag. The bag. Do y'all want the bag? Let's get to the bag. What are y'all talking about? Let's get to the bag. Come on, ladies, we're gonna go get to the bag. Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, welcome, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back. We are gonna get right into these remote jobs, starting off with Enlight, and this is for their auto claims Q&A specialist. Now, a little bit about the job description. They say you will perform or confirm production and quality audits for auto claims. You will also assure compliance in in-house and or external specifications for standard methods and procedures that result in precision, accuracy, and reliability of audited work. You will also ensure quality of claims are in accordance with several level agreements and operation manuals. You will also participate in reviewing the process designs to contribute quality requirements and considerations. So what is required for this role? Well, you need a high school diploma. They say if you have a college degree that is preferred, but you do not need it. You also need your medical coder certifications, whether it's in one of these areas or another related field. They say auto claims auditing experience is also required. Now here are some of their preferred skills and these are honestly just going to be soft skills. So I would not focus too much on those. This job does pay up to $22.59 an hour. And of course it does come with benefits. Now we are on to House Call Pro, and this is for their sales development representative. Now this role does pay up to $70,000 annually, but they do say that there is a potential for you to earn uncapped commission. Now why House Call Pro? They say help us build solutions that better lives. At House Call Pro, we show up to work every day to make a difference for real people. The home service professionals that support America's 100 million homes. We are all about the pros and dedicate our days to helping them streamline operations, scale their businesses, and ultimately save time so they can be with their families and live well now they also do offer benefits as far as medical dental vision etc now a little bit about the role they say as a sales development representative also known as a sdr at house call pro you are driving force behind our sales efforts you play a pivotal role in identifying and engaging with potential customers ultimately fueling our growth you are passionate about building relationships comfortable with communicating over the phone and through various digital channels and excited about connecting our services to professionals with solutions that improve their business now, what will you be doing on each day? They say you will collaborate with our sales team to drive new enrollment of service professionals. You will also understand our pros day-to-day -day challenges and goals and communicating the value our company adds to their life. You will also convey and internalize empathy for pros pains to foster trust and connections, which show our brand is deeper than just transactional sales. So what are the qualifications for this role? Well, you need one year of proven experience working as a sales development representative or another related field. They say a high school diploma is required, but if you have a college degree, that is preferred. Everything else down here is going to be soft skills. So if you guys have been trying to figure out where you can find the links for these listings at, it's located on my website and the website link is right there in my description box. Now, a thing about my website is all of these jobs are verified leads. So you won't run into scams that you typically would on Indeed or other hiring websites. Another thing about my website is I upload way more on here. So typically on YouTube, I probably give you guys about 20 job leads per week. On here, I upload between 80 to 100 verified remote job leads per week. Not only that, but I also upload these job links way ahead before I post them anywhere on my social media. So you will typically see these job listings posted five days to a week before they ever make it on to my TikTok or YouTube. So if you guys are interested, just click that link in the description box. Now we are on to UMA, also known as Ultimate Medical Academy, and they are hiring for their Quality Assurance Coordinator. Now, the purpose of this position, they said the Quality Assurance Coordinator role is responsible for ensuring the effectiveness of the quality of career services, interactions with students, graduates, and employer partners across all channels of communications. The quality assurance coordinator works closely with team leaders, operational support, and other quality assurance resources to monitor calls, texts, and emails, research activities in the customer relationship management, also known as CRM, and gather results that point to training opportunities or other areas where performance metrics can be improved through coaching. Now, they go on to talk a little bit more about UMA. They say they are a nonprofit healthcare educational institution with a national presence. 
Now, when they go on to talk a little bit more about the role, they say it does pay up to $22 an hour along with benefits. Now, when we get down here to the key responsibilities, they say you will review graduate and employer facing conversations across all communication channels to evaluate team performance and track customer support quality. You will also assess support interactions based on internal standards and provide constructive feedback. You will also help advisors improve their performance with specific instructions and contact support. Now, getting down here, these are the minimum requirements to apply. You need a high school diploma or a GED. They also say you need at least one year experience performing quality assurance functions, preferably within a call center environment that is primarily outbound. They also say that you need a high degree of personal integrity and everything else down here is going to be preferred skills or soft skills. Now we are on to another UMA job, also known as Ultimate Medical Academy. This is for their student finance advisor. The purpose of this position is to assist the admissions department by advising prospective students about the completion of the financial aid process so that the school can request disbursements of their funds. To collect on non-Title V funds on an as-scheduled basis and to advise continuing students, including those preparing for externships or graduation, about options to address their account balances before they leave school. So we've already been over that UMA is a nonprofit healthcare educational institution. Let's get down here to the job benefits. So this job does start at $18 an hour. Of course, it does offer benefits like medical, dental, vision, life insurance, et cetera. They say you will coordinate communications to students and send emails where appropriate. You will follow up on FAFSA and missing document renewals for continuing students. You will also work on externships and graduation clearance processes so students don't leave school with a balance. Now, the education and experience you need to get this role. They say a high school diploma is required. If you have a bachelor's degree, that is a plus, but it's not required. They also say they would like for you to have at least two years working in accounting or finance that is preferred but it's not required. So for this role, you actually don't need any experience, but you are required to have a high school diploma or a GED at minimum. Now we are on to VACO, and this is for their senior design specialist. Now this role does pay up to $85 an hour. Let's get into what this job is about. They say the senior design strategist is a seasoned professional responsible for crafting user experiences that are not only aesthetically pleasing, but also deeply resonates with the users. This role involves a combination of strategic thinking, user-centered design methodologies, and leadership capabilities. Here's an overview of the key aspects associated with this position. So for the education slash experience, you need eight years of experience in product design, service design, or user experience. You also need practical application of design thinking and human-centered design methods. You also need a portfolio showcasing completed projects, experience in identifying, engaging, and interviewing research participants, preferably formal education or a certificate in relevant areas like human-centered design, design thinking, Learn Six Sigma. So the skills, knowledge, and abilities, they also say they want you to have excellent knowledge of user-centered design principles, the ability to facilitate complex design discussions and drive results, effective communication of the benefits and insights of user research to cross-functional teams, proactive identification and preparation of business case for process improvement opportunities, and monitoring development of metrics and reporting business process performances. Now we are on to Instacart, and this is for their strategic financial analyst. This is a contract role, so they will not be offering things like medical, dental, and vision. Please do keep that in mind when applying to this role. I'm pretty sure we all know who Instacart is, but I will read a small snippet of their company mission. They say at Instacart, we invite the world to share love through food because we believe everyone should have access to the food they love and more time to enjoy it together. Where others see a simple need for grocery delivery, we see an exciting company complexity, and endless opportunity to serve the varied needs of our community. Now, 
Coming down here, they do say that there is no one size fits all to the approach of how we do our best work. Our employees have the flexibility to choose where they do their work best, whether it's from home, in office, or your favorite coffee shop. So guys, of course, you guys know I only talk about remote jobs, so this is a remote job. Now, a little bit more about the role. They say as a strategic financial analyst contract, you will have the ability to both operate at the lowest level of detail and consider the big picture and drive strategic and investment recommendations. You will have exceptional analytical capabilities, excel in data-driven decision-making, and are clear, confident communicators. Now about the role, they say as the minimum qualifications, you need a bachelor's degree in math, economics, finance, business, or any other related field. You also need three years experience in a related field with demonstrated financial acumen and a track record of leveraging data for business impact. Now this role does pay up to $75 an hour, and of course it does come with benefits.